Well, grab your pearls and get ready. For the first time since 1999, the Atlanta Braves are in the World Series. And now fans are putting their hope in the home team as they prepare to face the Houston Astros. Joining me now to talk about it all is Atlanta Braves in-game host and radio personality, Mark Owens. Mark, this is a great opportunity. Congratulations to you. But first, let's talk about what this means for the fans because they lined up yesterday at Truist Park to send the team off in style. So this is really going to mark a milestone for more than 20 yeah. years in the making, right? Since 1999. That's the last time the Braves have been to the World Series. And it's super exciting. Uh, the fans are excited. You saw it yesterday. Hundreds of fans lined up to wave them as they walked down the red carpet, as they got on the buses to say goodbye. Uh, Jock Peterson was there. He talked to the crowd a little bit. Brian Snicker talked to the crowd a little bit. And look, that was a Monday morning, mind you. A Monday morning. <laughs> and Pete, Listen, I don't want to put anybody's business out there, but I saw a lot of kids playing hooky just to cheer on their Atlanta Braves. So needless to say, the Braves country is really excited. Look, I don't think the teachers will be upset or the principals that they were out there enjoying it because we all are, right? And, and Mark, the Braves right. kind of struggled early in the season. A few months ago, some may not have thought they would even go to the World Series. So just how much has this team overcome? It's been a weird season for the Atlanta Braves, and I'm guilty of this as well. You know, I'm, I'm your in-game host for the Braves. I, it's my job to be hyped and be excited about the Atlanta Braves. But if you would ask me back in June, what would we be doing in October? I said, you know, I'm going to be playing golf. You know, I'm going to be watching <laughs> football on the weekends. But they overcame so much. Uh, you know, Mike Soroka, one of the starting pitchers, wasn't available all season. Obviously, we know about uh, Ozuna and his off-field issues that he's dealing with. Ronald Acuna goes down. We lose him. But they made some amazing moves after the All-Star break, and the Braves ended up having one of the best records post-All-Star break. They weren't even above 500 until August. And now look at us. There are two teams left in Major League Baseball, a team that they said at the beginning of the season wasn't even going to be in the top three of the NL East. And look at us now. I hate to say I'm actually shocked as well, too. I mean, and they were talking, the team members were saying that, you know, it's a surreal feeling to know that they're there, they're in the World Series. And we're excited, too, and it is surreal for us as well. And you're a big Braves fan. You know this team well. What will it take for them to win the World Series? Uh, not let the moment get ahead of them. Because for so many of these players, a lot of these players weren't even born. Or maybe they were just one or two years old. <clears throat> I lost my voice over the weekend. My apologies. <laughs> Look, we were so excited Saturday night when we clinched the National League Championship. So a lot of these players have never been in this moment before. Yes, they've seen success. Yes, they've had minor postseason runs. But this is the World Series. So I think the team's just going to have to take a deep breath, live in the moment, enjoy the moment, but also know that we still have a game to play. Mm -hmm. These are the two best teams in all of baseball. This is going to be a fantastic series. There's going to be watch parties out of the battery. They're back home this weekend. It's a great time to be a Braves fan. And I think all of Braves country is super excited, nervous, as we should be, mm -hmm. but really excited. I mean, everyone's watching. The country is watching. The world yeah. is watching. And you know what, Don't Mark? sleep on it. Don't, Don't sleep. sleep on the Braves. No, you can't, right? You can't. Nope. Nope. Get nope. some uh, tea and honey. Work on that vocal cord. We don't want There's, you to lose your it's voice. It's going to be a great weekend. It's give, give yourself plenty of time. If you're coming out to the battery, big crowds expected. It's going to be a lot of fun. All right. Mark, really thank you. Go Braves. Appreciate it. Go Braves. And you can keep up with Mark on Instagram at Marco6262.